I want to know if I can take this plate off and have the motor still held together so that I can just replace this plate with another one or whether this plate actually does something so I'm just going to take it off and uh, see what happens Together. Come on. Okay. It does have the uh, the piece for the bearing to sit in, so it is important. Dirt uh. here. No, this won't roll that all the way. Hell up by that anyway. Massive. Okay. It's got to go back on. Right, now I'm going to uh, need a template to make an adapter to fit the electric motor which is just up there onto the, uh, onto the transmission. Now on this uh, motor here there is a steel plate that comes around it holds, holds a bell housing and a few other pieces um, and it has all the holes to line up the transmission so I'll take this off and I'll show you just how easy it's going to be. There's the template. It goes straight on there like that. Perfect. It's raining outside now, so I'm going to uh calling it for a day. It's going to get cold inside this tin shed very fast. Um, so here's the template of the uh, transmission. Um, I know that it's going off the uh, going off the, the engine there. It, it sort of roughly sits around here. So what I'm thinking I might do is get that piece of steel a piece of steel that I have out of my parents' place. Um, and I'm probably just going to make a big disc like that. Covers up this whole bottom piece and this whole top piece up here. Uh, and then I'll go from there, you know, make little centers and line it up properly in that. Um, but that's going to be it. So I will see you guys later.